we want to use git add in order to add file context to our index. To this end, we take a look at the git status command that we covered in another video. The output of this command tells us that a file that we have been tracking has been modified and the, that we should use git add with the file name in order to update the changes. So in our case, the file is called readme.md, therefore we type git add readme.md. We can now run git status again in order to see that now readme.md has been listed as changed files to be committed.